Hey guys, Coding here, and today I wanted to show what I've been working on, which is the GamePie 20. And I think this um, handheld is pretty good. Probably even better than the GPI case because it um, has a rechargeable battery, and even though it doesn't have a D pad, but I think it's really good for what it is. And also, I wanted to show that I have gotten. PS1 emulator working well by using the other emulator that is not the default one. So I wanted to show what it what that looks like. So I'm gonna show a little test of Crash Bandicoot on this thing. So let's see how that works. As you can see, there is no um, sound lag in this in this game, and it's running pretty good. So let me head to the menu because I have a, key a keyboard connected to this. Because so, um, every time I start the system up, it always defaults to this weird pinout input. I mean, which I don't know why I. I might try to fix it. If you guys have any ideas about how to fix it, let me know in the comments down below. But that's what I have so far. And let me press menu. So as you see, I got right there. But let me check the FPS. Oop. There we go. There we go. Escape. As you can see, it's running. Let's see if we can get that close up. It's running around 60 FPS. 60, 60 to 30, which is pretty good. Not that bad. So let me see if I can get some gameplay on this. There we go. And then let's go. There is a little bit of frame skipping, but I think it's running pretty good. I will be trying to test other PS1 games with this and hope it for the best I can get it working with these buttons as well. So that's all I pretty much have, but yeah. As always, please leave a comment down below. And feel free to subscribe. And I'll try my best to make more videos out soon. As always, thanks for watching. Have a good one.